Hi, I'm Anna Gare and each week I'll be bringing you fresh ideas to help create quick and easy meals that are great value and delicious. Look at that. Today it's Niswa salad with fresh tuna and baby red delight potatoes. I just love a hearty salad for dinner that doesn't stop you in your tracks but it still fills you up. You'll need tuna steaks, baby red delight potatoes, baby cos, select red wine vinegar, select kalamata olives and select free range eggs. All ingredients can be purchased at your local Woolies and online by clicking here. So I've got eight little baby red delight potatoes on the boil. Trim up some green beans. I only take the end off where it was attached to the plant because the ends are really chewy, so you don't want them in there. I'm going to blanch them in my potato water because that's already boiling. Pop that lid on for a minute and we'll get these little fragile eggs down into the boiling water with a spoon so they don't crack for a nice soft egg. Boil them six to seven minutes. If they come straight out of the fridge, they'll need a few minutes extra. Plunge the beans into the cold water. That will stop them from cooking anymore. We want them to stay crunchy, so put them on a tea towel to drain. Check those baby potatoes with a skewer or a fork. If it glides in nicely, and it does, the potatoes are ready. So we're just going to leave those potatoes steam and now we're going to get on to those tuna steaks. You can see that these are absolutely fresh. You can eat it raw. Heat up a pan to cook the tuna. Oil the tuna steak and not the pan because otherwise the oil will burn. Pepper and a little bit of salt. Get your hands in and rub that all into the tuna steaks. That's looking lovely. Make sure your pan is really, really hot. It should sizzle just like that. Sear it for two minutes on each side. Nice. Okay, the fish is ready. We do not want to overcook it, otherwise it becomes dry. Let the fish rest for two minutes so the residual heat heats up the centre of the fish. And now we're going to build the salad. Move the bottom. Always lay down the big leaves first, the little ones at the end, because they're very pretty. Save a few of these little cos leaves from the heart for the top. Next up, our potatoes. Quarter these. I just love these little baby red delight potatoes because they've got this wonderful, dense, creamy flesh which just works beautifully in this salad. Scatter them evenly. Cut two Roma tomatoes into nice little wedges. So gorgeous. Add the beautiful red colour to this salad. If it's colourful, it's good for you. Put most of the beans over now. Save some for the top. Look at those beautifully matching colours. Beautiful kalamata olives, so salty and yummy. Slice up our gorgeous tuna steak, nice and thinly. Look at that, beautiful pink colour. Place the tuna on top of the salad so it looks pretty. Now, I think this salad calls for a creamy, tangy dressing. Usually it's made with a vinaigrette, but I like something a little bit creamier, so I'm going to add two generous tablespoons of Greek yoghurt into a bowl about two tablespoons of olive oil, one teaspoon of Dijon mustard, one tablespoon of red wine vinegar, pepper and salt. Give it a little whisk. Drizzle of that creamy dressing. A few other little beans on top. Olives. And then I've got the little baby cos. And now for the soft, gooey eggs, tear them apart. And you can tell we've got free range eggs here. So one more drizzle of that creamy, tangy dressing. And there you have it. Fresh and hearty Niswa salad with tuna and baby red delight potatoes that won't leave you hungry. Now, if you liked that, all the ingredients can be purchased at your local Woolies and online by clicking here. To subscribe to our YouTube channel, click here. And to explore all our other fresh ideas recipes, click here.